The largest study ever on American Jewish teens paints a picture of a cohort that simultaneously embraces family, Jewish culture, and friends, while also grappling with anxiety and pressure to succeed in a world permeated by social media and constant communication. Researched and written by the Jewish Education Project and Rossov Consulting, Gen Z Now, Understanding and Connecting with Jewish Teens Today, shares survey results and interview responses from a total of 17,576 teens to reveal data and insights about their interests, challenges, and passions in all facets of life in unprecedented depth and scope. The research informs a new significant paradigm shift in how we approach teen themselves and the Jewish teen initiatives offered to them, moving beyond thinking about teens as recipients of Jewish learning experiences. We don't want to ask, what can we do to these teens? We don't even want to ask to narrowly focus on how we can empower teens, a term that may have lost its meaning over time. Rather, the question is, how might we understand and engage the teen as a whole person, and how can Judaism enrich and deeply influence his or her whole life? The report identified 14 outcomes that can be utilized across organizations and programs to determine if we collectively offer teens Jewish opportunities that actually move the needle. See, Jewish teens have a stronger sense of self. They feel a sense of pride about being Jewish. They have experienced learning that has been both challenging and valuable. They have learned things that enable them to be more active participants in the Jewish communities. They learn about and positively experience Jewish holidays and Shabbat. They establish strong friendships. They develop strong and healthy relationships with their families. They develop significant relationships with their mentors, their role models, and educators. They're able to express their values and ethics in relationship to Jewish principles and wisdom. Jewish teens also have the develop, develop the capacity, skills, and language that allows them to grapple with and express their spiritual journeys. They feel connected to various communities. They develop the desire and commitment to be part of the Jewish people now and in the future. They develop a positive relationship to the land, people, and state of Israel. And they are inspired and empowered to make a positive difference in various communities in the world in which they live. Now, to be clear, not every Jewish program for teens will address all 14 desired outcomes. But the hope is that teens who engage in a variety of different programs over the course of their development experience the large majority of them. To that end, after the initial research and interactions with teens, the Jewish Education Project developed seven teen-centered questions for organizations to bear in mind when designing teen initiatives. How will this engage me intellectually, physically, and socially? How can I share this with my friends, both Jewish and other? How can I apply this to my life? How will this help me develop skills that will benefit my life? How will this make me or help me feel proud of being Jewish? How will this help me become a better citizen of this world? How can this help me or how will this help me make the world a better place? These questions can be guiding principles in shaping the design of initiatives to achieve the desired outcomes. With this research, we can ask ourselves, how does character development contribute to achieving the goals and outcomes presented? How can we as educators facilitate the building of resilient teens, and what opportunities can we provide them in a Jewish context to support this? It has been my pleasure to serve as your instructor for this summer session. I hope you have learned something new, and I hope that you can apply it to your work.